Warning. The content here has been rated MA18 by the YouTube overlords. Viewer discretion is advised. Enjoy the show my peeps skipping the rest. Like. Help me hit today's like goal of 1-0. You are all wicked awesome. Sub. 683. We gotta bump those numbers up. 1-7 more to 700 my peeps. Let's go. Donations. If you would like to support my work, drop a super chat or just donate to my channel please hit the cash app link, skipping the rest. Wake up with Warpath, a warm cup of coffee some fun laughs here at 7am. Avocado time every Monday through Saturday. Title. Warpath TV, current stream title, Red Dead Online Weekly Reset 99 Roll Grind Free Aim Tips Tricks Comedian Voice Actor Funny.
All right. Good morning, my peeps. It's Tuesday morning. It's the weekly reset here on Red Dead Online. Welcome to the show. It's I, Warpath. Welcome to Warpath TV. Hope you are enjoying your week so far. It's the second day of the week, so it can't be that enjoyable. Let me dial in everything here real quick while everybody's piling in and whatnot. I got to get my intel up here. We wait for everyone to dial in. Weekly reset day. Got to go over here to my Red Dead Online news feed line. <clears throat> Excuse me. All right, all right, all right. Let me go over here. Let me start off by going to my mailbox first. What's up, Sumesh? Good morning. Oh, a name that I kind of despise now a name that shall not be spoken ever again not your name but the name you wrote in the chat <laughs> let me pick up all my goodies here and then we could talk about what we need to do ancient tools is the weekly shopping list Let's go over here by the hitching post where my horse is mysteriously missing all right, as you can see, we're out here in New Austin. Um, I set up camp this week out here in New Austin. Hey, Warpath, you had an intro that stacks or someone else made it. What happened to that? Uh, hold on a second. Uh, we're out here in Gaff Tooth Ridge. We'll probably be out here for the week. Uh, Somar, you're saying you had an intro stacks or someone else made it. What happened to that? Uh, what do you mean? I've had a few intros, so um, I had an intro song that AAP made, Make It Burn, but I decided to go with a more traditional song. I might go back to Make It Burn here <coughs> if I do like something, a newer game. Um... Stax did a, a welcome to my channel video. So did PB Jake. PBJ and Jake, so. Let's get into this week's reset stuff while we have a chance here. Let me get a close up of myself here, Mr. DeVille. There we go. Nice little close up skis of myself while I talk. There we go. Now you got a good little view of me. All right. This week in Red Dead Online. Yeah, one. Welcome to my channel one. Yeah, I, I've had a couple of those. I've had a, a couple of welcome to my channels. They're in my um, welcome to my channel uh, collection. I have a uh, certain collections on my um, page. If you go onto my page there, you can see the different collections. Just go on to welcome to my page. It's in there if you want to see it. This week in Red Dead Online, participate in any free room events and receive a pair of black pelt half chaps. This week's feature series is the Hardcore Showdown series. Madame Nazar's weekly collection is the Ancient Tools collection. Let's take a look at it, shall we? The Ancient Tools collection consists of... The Obsidian Arrowhead and the Horsehair Brush, which we have both of those. So the Obsidian Arrowhead and the Horsehair Brush. You can get those turned in for $75 for the whole set value. Just thought I'd let you know. Maybe I should leave that up. Let's leave that up for right now while I read through everything else here. Go. Ancient Tools Collection. There we go. That's this week's collection. Everything else remains the same for the month. Four times XP free roam events. Three times RDO money and XP on free roam missions. Three times RDO money and XP on telegram missions. Three times RDO money and XP on land of opportunity missions. Two times gold and two times ability card XP on all call to arms. Two times RDO money and XP on all featured series. If you reach wave 10 and call to arms, you receive a red and orange Ortega vest. 
Complete three daily challenges to receive an offer for 40% off a coat, premium cigarettes, and a reward for 5,000 XP. Boom, bang, bing. That also maxes out. Um, I think they give you three total. Three total of the uh, coupons is the max. So if you do those, they give you three total to max out. Complete any new source of employment mission to receive a North Tumbleweed treasure map. Returning limited stock items is the Eberhardt coat, Carver pants, Strickland boots, and the Gardena hat. The free community outfit consists of, let's go take a look at it. Well, I read it off to you guys. Let's go over here to my good old tent skis. So you guys can take a look at it while I read it to you. Excuse me, Nakoma. This is the April outfit right here. It consists of the gambler's hat, the trim bandana, which is not seen here. I uh, took it off so you guys can see the shirt fully. Um, the classic frock coat, the everyday shirt, which is the male version. It's in white. The Insta shirt waist for the female. The Slazo double bandolier, which I took it off so you guys could fully see the Smash jacket the like. and everything. Hit that sub box. Never miss any of my content drops here on Warpath TV. The Lancer vest for the male, the Valdez vest for the female. Leather gloves, uh, you can get them in black or brown. I believe the black ones are free. The cuffed town pants and the worn roper boots. You'll need to claim each specific colored item individually at the general store or at any of the tailors on the map. Free fast travel you throughout the outfit. month. What was that? I bet you gambled on that outfit. Yeah, right. Uh, free free fast travel uh, throughout this month. Um, so any fast travel throughout the month is going to be free no matter what. If, it, if it's at a fast travel post or through your mini camp, no matter what, fast travel is free. <laughs> 30% off on the most overrated horse in the game. That's the Arabian horse. 30% off all boots and hats. There are weapon-related discounts. But um, as I say every week, the guy that I get my information from every week for the weekly reset, he's not allowed to post it because the even though it's a video game, the powers that be, whether it be... I'm not going to name off the names. Any social media um, or video uh, content creation format does not like any source of um, weapons being put out in any sort of manner or you know view. Even though it's in a game, they don't like. Oh, you know, we don't like you guys talking about guns or violence or weapons or anything. But hey. Here's a video that we condone of these people that are shutting down the freeway the and, to see and, what's the and, and they're, they're, about. they're shutting down traffic and they're causing violence in the name of a country that they know nothing about. But hey, you know, that's a whole nother subject. We won't get into that. But anyways, yeah, so that's this week's uh, content for the weekly reset. Um, if you want to find out more about everything that's going on, you can check out the Rockstar Newswire or you can just wait until later today when uh, Rockstar will put it up in the benefits page. Um, they'll have it reset in here. All through here, they'll have it all reset. So just to let you guys know. With that all being said, let's get into today's dailies. Let's get the 9 for 9 rolling. That's what you guys are all here for. Cook sees an exotic bird. Oh, we happen to have an exotic bird. Row a boat or canoe. We could probably do that. We're definitely going to catch a fish that's worth five. Excuse me, five pounds. Come join the new Warpath TV Red Dead at Step Children Discord um, server at URL. I'm not a big fan of doing Jang's Layton missions just because it deals with hunting. It, it deals with basically grifting players in the map, and I'm not big on that, dude. So, uh, player kills and versus, I'm not doing that. Prairie poppies, we could do that. Whole animal cars is sold. Might be able to do that. New Hanover. Loot them. 
Take him down with the bola. We could do that. Special stew. We might be able to pull these off. Definitely going to pull these off. Got to do this. I don't know about story missions. We just finished up the story missions. I don't know if I want to restart those just yet. Oh, the infamous don't kill a fucking animal for 24 hours. So, so basically we got, we got plenty. We got three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. So we got, we definitely got plenty to do today. So, uh, yeah, let's get to it. Yeah. Um, first things first, let's. Well, we, that could be put in, that could be put in on that seven, so I'm not worried about that. Prairie poppies are all over by black water. Nakoma, callese. So I don't have to pop any tonics, so that's good. All right. Let me get a stew going. Hopefully it's a special one. Ah, what are we missing? Oh, mint? Okay. Um, mint. This is probably not mint. Yeah, creepy time. Mint's more by water. So, what I'm going to do, so I'm going to start off with the Moonshine Shack first, because I know there's mint there. I just don't think there's any mint out here, per se, unless we're by the water, and I know we're not by any water right here. We're over by Tumbleweed, yeah. We're on the ridge. Well, at least we know where Madame Nazar's at. Um, what were the collectibles? Let's pop those real quick. Coins and fossils. Well, I know fossils are going to be all balls deep. So, you know what? I'm just going to go up there. Let's do this. Let's do this. Let's get this show started. They had it one time where all the meat at the butcher was free. After that, I had the bad case of the worms. Oh, like that's not good, dude. Help me hit today's like goal of one zero. You are all wicked awesome. That's not good at all. Sub. I I had no idea that I was Six, out eight, three. of uh. We gotta bump those numbers up. One seven more to seven zero zero, my peeps. Let's go. I had no idea I was out of, um, mint, man. I usually have a gang of that on deck. Oh, nice. Here's a fossil right here. So we got a leg up on it already. Never will buy from the butcher again. That how did <laughs> MOG waving hand? What's up, Kratos? How you doing, well. buddy? MOG grinning face. Oh yeah, I hope all's well with you too, my friend. I woke up at 3:30 this morning, thinking it was 6:30. I uh, was watching the Kings game last night, and they were getting their butts kicked. So I went to bed early. I didn't want to watch them get their butts kicked anymore, so I kind of just shut the game off and crashed out. And then I woke up early. I was like, dude, what time is it? Is it 5.30, 6.30? Because I heard some birds chirping, and I was like, what's going on? So I woke up, and I went, 
you know, went to the bathroom, checked my clock, and I'm like, dude, it's barely 318. What the fuck? Went back to bed. Got up at 5. Like, dude, this sucks. I hate when that happens, man. You guys, don't you guys hate when that happens? You guys, like, wake up unexpectedly early. I, I fucking hate that shit. Um, yeah. I don't know, man. Just thought I'd share that. If you guys are looking for the weekly reset information, just rewind um, back just a little bit. You'll see me standing in camp. I broke down everything for the weekly reset already. Uh, did that first and foremost before I did the dailies. So if you're just if you're just tuning in, before you hit that like, go rewind just a little bit right after the intro. Get your information for the weekly. It's not a whole lot. We're almost out of this month, though. We're almost out of this month. Hopefully, next month will be collector month, and then we'll, we'll have a bunch of good stuff to do. Okay, so for sure we got plenty of... For sure. For sure we got plenty of that mint, man. Plenty of that mint, man. We got plenty of it, man. And now, <laughs> la touche secrète. Parfait. The parfait. Parfaits are good, man. I've been macking down on some parfaits lately ever since I had that little surgery. Just a little bit of yogurt, some fucking granola. When I were younger, I was up at the crack of dawn. Now I'm older, I'm lucky I'm still breathing. Yeah, yeah, I feel ya. A little bit of yogurt, some granola, some honey. My, uh, my roommate, he went to Mexico a couple weeks ago. He's got, like, a girlfriend in a bunch of different countries and shit. And one of them's down in Mexico. She gave him this big old thing of, like... All natural, like straight from the bee's ass fucking honey. And it came in this big old like tequila bottle. Oh man, it's so good. Some of the best honey I've ever had in my life, dude. So bomb. So good. So good. 17 seconds. Oh uh, my goodness. I was wondering when you were going to get here. This is a good batch, of course. They are all good batches, but... This one is D -D -D superior, run across eh? the Del Lobo I have found a buyer who will appreciate it. And most important, they will pay for it too. Now, all you have to do is to be attentif, eh? Seigneur, ayez pitié. Smash that like. Hit the sub box. Never miss any of my content drops here on Warpath TV. wasn't stopping anyway. After yesterday's then show. Then we need a whole wagon just to get Little Jack drunk. Yeah, right? After uh, yesterday's stream, I tried to go back and Oh, what the fuck? Dude, I didn't even push a button, dude. What the fuck? I tried to go back and uh, 
find those three dudes that were in Valentine that tried to like grip me. I, I don't know. They weren't trying to grip me. I think they just thought I was the dude that they were hunting or fighting when I pulled in after that. That uh, land of opportunities mission. Dude, I searched the whole map for those three, dude. And I couldn't find them. They were in the lobby. I just couldn't fucking find them. I wanted to fight them. I just couldn't find them. I don't know, man. After about like 15 or 20 minutes of trying to find them, I just couldn't find them. They ended up leaving the lobby. I said, fuck it. Not worth it. I was going to see if River wanted to team up and just fucking hand them fools an ass with them. But couldn't find them, so I didn't want to waste River's time. Nudes that hop on and think they're hot shit. Well, fuck, man. Nine times out of ten, they're. They think it's part of the game, I think. Even though I never did that when I first started. I tried to avoid as many people as I could when I first started playing this game. I had friends though that would play and they were fucking all about running up on fools. Same here, I play alone. Like my buddy Borst. <laughs> we would be in a posse. And he would he would just wander off purposely start shit with like level four, five, six hundreds. This dude was barely a level one hundred. It's like, dude, stop. You know, fucking knock it off, man. But he just, he just always would do it. I get creepers every day. Usually low levels, MOG wide smile, MOG rolling on the floor laughing. It was. Yeah, I'm just but talk. I don't mind helping other players when they need the help. Yeah, I don't mind either. Sometimes they won't. Yeah, it's cool. Alright, it's cool. It's not here. A few players act like total assholes when you try to help. Thing is, I know a load of high level PvP guys, gals. Always ready to jump in, cat orange whistling. Oh, yeah. Well, I mean, that's come join the new Warpath TV Red Dead Instead Children Discord server at URL. One of the things is uh, a lot of a lot of people they know that uh, when I pop my uh, posse open, that basically means just like one thing. You know what I mean? That either means. Tag along Tuesday, or that means 
Once again, it's on. You know what I mean? So. A lot of times when I open my posse, especially like when I'm offline, I'm not streaming. kid <laughs> he sees that as like it's like the bat signal dude it's crazy if you were doing a tackle on tuesday on the xbox i'm there oh yeah i i wish i wish i could man oh what the fuck As a high level, just attract idiots, eyes purple crying. Exotic. First time I played RDR2 on the PC, I didn't know shit, but over the years I learned a lot. Just takes time. Alright, we got two of those. That's that. Two more of these. Eight. Nine. Oh, I can't make no more. Okay. And then. Can't do minty. I'm gonna save my mint. Them bottle contains my worst farts that I ever had. Oh man, I had some steamy ones last night. Not to bring up some shit, but I swear, man, every time I eat Italian food, that's like my kryptonite, dog. Alright, that was seven. Cool, we'll eat this one. Then we'll go back. I always like to set myself up, so we'll get these two coins, and then um, we need to go see Madame Zar. Good I morning, MOG hot beverage. My farts are worse than benign in the gas chamber. <laughs> Good morning, Genie in the bottle. 
not something you probably hmm. wanted to walk into first thing in the morning was uh, Cabot Kisser talking about his farts. Use but, this yeah. link to maximize your collector role adventures. URL. Bonjour, patron. So let me pull that up here. Mekotamash. Smash that like. Hmm. Hit that sub box. There are things you Never could miss do any to of my content price, drops huh? here on Warpath TV. This will be a little out of the ordinary, yes? Wake up with Warpath, a warm cup of coffee, some fun laps here at 7 a.m. Avocado time every Monday through Saturday. Good news! We All have right. some new clients, I see. So we definitely gotta go get these last two coins. Finish that up. We gotta get a couple more. The Elder Scroll is not a bad RPG game. No, it's not. It's not at all. Hopefully we get a fishing derby. I can get that knocked out. If there's not one at eight, then we'll jump into one. Um, I'm gonna go back. We're gonna make a stew. I'll get these last two coins. I'll get the everything else here. It will take me a little time to get used to it. Go. Pull that up just for the fossils. Okay, That's see. what I get for being so late, lol. Ah, uh, you're good, you're good, you're good. Don't trip chocolate chip. We're gonna go, go grab this one. Ram Batter, welcome to the show. Thank you for being here. Oh, I appreciate you. Thank you. Just working on this nine for nine. If you're looking for the weekly reset information, just uh, rewind back to the sh beginning of the stream. I give you all the intel. There's not a lot. Um, it's mostly the stuff they just talk about. Um, Nazar stuff. And then I just bring up everything else up. It's going on for the month. Nothing new, nothing exciting. Kind of a dead month, so appreciate you guys being I here. The Elder Scroll for five dollars at the flea market. I want to see what all the hype about this game. It's just really well put together. It takes some time. I mean, you're gonna probably spend at least, at least an hour putting your character together. Yeah, it's one of those games, dude, where it's very intricate. Especially when it comes to, like, creating your character and shit. stuff up over here digging through the mud for what a can of pork and beans hey man this day and age can of pork and beans takes you a long way buying economy and shit you know how it goes 
I got beans and bologna. Oh, look, I'm the first one here. I'm gonna close it, too, so, so somebody thinks that they're the first one here, too. I'm just gonna close it, so the next person... Oh, I'm the first one here! And I like to go down here and... Always raid the cabinet. There's always jewelry in the cabinet. Oh, jewelry in the cabinet! I take it a one jewelry. I take out the two jury, but not the three jury. No, no, no. Don't want to be greedy. I got beans and bologna. Dude, what are you doing? What are you doing? Where? Are you? Oh my God, dude. Where are you going? There you go. Cut the hole. There you go. I walking for an old guy to come out and scream out, Hey you little basters, get off of my lawn. Get off my lawn. There's a big old M1 Grand and shit. Alright, so this one is down here by Ruads. So we're gonna have to go down here and get it. I'm gonna pop a camp over yonder. the hummingbird and lavender in the great fields. Is that a fucking snake by me? I hear something. I didn't think there was snakes out here. I didn't think there was snakes out here. Oh, there's a snake in my boot. When I got, when I'm fast travel, there we go. When I'm fast traveling and shit, I always try to like answer messages on my phone. I used to turn my phone off, like, uh, like put it on airplane mode and shit. But then when I got done streaming, I, I take it off of that. What was that? Undisturbed? Don't disturb or whatever. I would take it off of that, dude. My phone would fucking light up like a Christmas tree and shit. Or if you're from Las Vegas, like a slot machine. I'm like, what the fuck, man? It wouldn't be nobody important or anything. It'd be mostly just like the characters and shit, you know. It'd be like, you know, bears wanting child support. you ran through the grizzlies i wish they come out with the legendary fish in rdr2 online i keep saying man they need to have it in the fishing tournaments you know on the public events no matter where you're uh fishing at they need to have at least one of the legendary fish in there come join the new warpath tv it. red dead Extent children discord server at url whoever catches it you know gets a bonus or whatever you know But, nope. There's a 
lot of stuff. Same here. In this game, that the files are there, but they just won't put it in the game. You know what I mean? Somebody lost their wagon. It's a hunting wagon, right? Alright. Let's get to camp. Consolidate. Make that stew. Go see Man Bazaar. Oh, wait, wait, wait. wait. Jones. Every game had files, stuff that was supposed to be in the game mess but never made into the game. Boom. I might not even need, need that map. I just open some and fucking go with the flow, you know what I'm saying? Let's see if there's one in New Austin that I can go back to. Bring it back, come rewind. Nah. Nah, there's none in New Austin at all. There is one, no. Uh, right on the river by McFarland Ranch. Smash that like. Hit that sub box. Never miss any of my content drops here on Warpath TV. It's actually... So it's going to be It's going to be right here. It's going to be right here. So, let's pop the top. Is that a fool? There is one. Nice. Nice. What's up, buddy? Christ. Get the fuck up out of here. Jack, homie. That's a nice little fucking rowboat, dog. I'd take this out on the fucking river. Not really, though. Oh, don't want to 
beach it, dog. Don't want to beach it. Fucking sandbar. The fucking sandbar. Stroke, smoke, stroke, smoke, stroke, smoke. Where's my buddy at? Oh, he disappeared. He drowned it. In. I'm gaining on this full. There we go. I'm gonna pack it over here. <laughs> there he is. Cool. He didn't drown it. He didn't drown it. All right. So she's out by. Armadilla. I'm gonna just knock this out now. Jumping into the level. Right. Help me hit today's like goal of one zero. You so are all liquid for awesome. Sure, I got so, a fucking six eight three. We gotta bump those numbers up. One seven more to seven zero zero, my peeps. This one? Let's go. Two. And then the miscellaneous always goes last. I thought for sure too, running right through that desert. Wake we up with kick warm hat, a warm cup of coffee, some fun laps here at 7 a.m. Avocado time every Monday through Saturday. There she goes. Dance for me. Dance for me, Madame Natsua. Dance back, for me. Sir. I am sure there is something here to pique your curiosity. Oh, for, oh, for shout. A shout here. Here's this week's goodie right. bag. And then I need to give you Charming some of this but shit. commonplace. Quite mundane, but I, I will take it. I need to give you some of this funny, dirty shit. That. But the whole set is worth your while. Yes, I know. I, know. Oh, I confess, I underestimated you. I'd like to keep the crazy 88s. But it's worth selling where these as a get set, that you know. Anyways, I'm trying to remember what I well, I well. I'd pay more for the whole set, you know. Well, well, the tea leaves told me it would be a good day. Oh, tea leaves. But it's worth selling these as a set, you know. That. But the whole set is worth your while. We got. Remember to buy those sweeter, M.O.G. or cat orange whistling. Oh, I always do. 
I was next Welcome out. then, and happy hunting. I know you will be lucky with this. Good luck then. I am sure this will be a most productive partnership. And anytime I gotta pick it, I just like delete Done. five or sell five to the. Oh, we gotta go pick up Prairie Poppy. Never mind. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna buy that right now. All right. I know where to get it too, because there's a shit ton of it in Blackwater. Morning parade, Kratos. MOG smiling eyes. Done. Hungry eyes. You could not bear to part with that. <sighs> well, I can wait. Alright. Let's see here. Do -do 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 -do. Camp. Greetings, MOG folded hands, Genie. Make this Crip Gang special stew. Let's see where we're at. We'll pop. We'll power up. Poss possibly armored up. And then we'll jump into the bounties. We're on track, so we're doing pretty good. We're doing pretty good on time. Oh, hell yeah. Sick. My buddies are back from Illinois from winning their tournament, and he just sent me a message saying, Look who is back, bro. Guys, guys! What's up, bud? Uh, like I was saying, my buddy just sent me a message. They'll be sending me a care package today, so hopefully I'll have it. Let's see, today's Tuesday. This is probably Thursday, Friday I'll have it. It'll be super sick. I love the way smoke runs, dude. So uh, graceful. So majestic, so graceful. package yeah so they're kind of like the sponsor of the show here not really but uh, the homie he runs uh, so you guys know that yeah. um, medical Mary Jane is legal here in California my buddy, he runs um, a hockey club, and he sponsors the hockey club, and when I told him about how I do my streams, he wanted to sponsor the stream, but it's hard to have Smash a sponsor the like, Hit the like sub that. Box. Never miss any of my content drops here on Warpath TV. When you're on YouTube and stuff, and they kind of frown upon it. Even though on YouTube they have like the legal cannabis commercials and stuff like that. Ha! 
it's kind of hard to, uh, you know, promote and do commercial spots and things like that. So if you want to check them out, um, go check them out. It's called Fro Bros Collective. Wake up with Warpath, a warm cup of coffee, some fun laughs here at 7 a.m. Avocado Bro time every Bros Monday through Collective. Saturday. Here, if you guys want, I'll put it in the chat so you guys know. Come join the new Warpath TV Red Deaded Step Children Discord server at URL. Pro Bro Collective. They are um, a dispensary out of California. So you, if you write that in and you're looking for like dispensaries out of California or whatever, that's the right place. Um, they distribute, you know, they do deliver like throughout the mail and stuff. So it's like legal as long as you're over the age of, I believe it's eight teen in California some states are 21 so just be wary of your state laws if you're looking if you're interested I know some of you guys are from a foreign country and it's highly illegal there so just be wary of your laws and where you're at I'm not trying to tell you or you know partake or anything like that it's all medical and please consult your doctor or anything like that make sure it's good with you beforehand um, I myself I do not like taking prescription medication for a few reasons. Um, I don't like because it's made out of the chemical and um, uh, petroleum based. Like all the medication I'm in is. UK, MOG flag, United yeah, Kingdom, see, eyes purple crying. Your probably best bet would just be to take the. I believe you guys have an underground train that goes to Amsterdam. I believe that that would probably be your best bet. But, um, like here, medication is a big deal. Pharmaceuticals and being that I have all the medical issues that I've had, especially with pain, chronic pain, um, arthritis and everything that I've gone through. I just, I've had a big issue with painkillers and, um, I was addicted for a long time, like in a bad way, and it took me a while to kick that habit. Face and, green uh, smiling. I figured uh, the herbal way is better than the chemical way, so that's why I do it. It helps me out a lot. When I just went through this procedure with, you know, the tumor in my in my insides, I probably wouldn't have got through it without my homies from Frobro Collective, so care package here in a couple days. It's going to be awesome. All right. Six, seven, eight, nine. We only need three more. So let's see here. That, that'll probably be one if we have to. So this is probably three. No handover. Oh, we need one more fossil. All right. Oh, that's right. It was over near McFarland Ranch. Okay. And then, uh, we'll go get that. I believe it was right here. So, let me, I'll put on my... Dude, that awesome, that's a battle right there, wouldn't wish it on anyone. My brother died because of that crap. Yeah. So, uh, what it's do you have? It's bad, dude. And I don't wish it on anyone, you know? So, it's tough. I have a lot of friends that are still going through that fight. Um, one of my best friends right now, he's, he's basically in the same position that I'm in. And he's quit. But sometimes he falls off the train and he gets back on and you know I can tell because he'll go ghost for a few days and I won't hear from him and then when I do hear from him he'll tell me he went on like a bender for a couple days and you know he was on Vicodin real bad and you know when he pops Vicodin he'll he'll pop a bunch dude and 
anybody that knows about Vicodin knows that, you know, it's all well and good. You don't feel no pain for the few days that you're on it. But when you're off of it, the withdrawals are super bad. And not only that, but it makes you super really bad constipated. And that's just another story in itself. So, um, Talks amongst yourselves real quick. I'll give you a topic. The Roman Empire was neither Roman nor an empire. Talks amongst yourselves. I'll be right back. Sorry about that. Oh. All right. I don't Let think they come from the Mongols for three zero zero Alex L O L. All right, let's roll. Getting a lot done. Getting a lot done. Let us get this last fossil that'll be wrapped up, and then we just need a couple of bounties. Reaper tree's done. There we go right there, McFarlane. Oh, McFarlane! I know Barney McFarlane. She's a good girl. Jeopardy reference, MOG wing. I slept with your mother last night, Trebek. <laughs> Those are great, dude. Some of the that was like right before uh, Saturday Night Live stopped being funny. Yeah, it's a 
My parents would watch it. Old school Saturday Night Live? Or Jeopardy? Old school Saturday Night Live was business, dude. Like, I know a lot of people that would watch it. I remember, um, I was playing hockey in Seattle, and that was, uh, that was one of the, one of the things that, you know, we would always do as a team would watch, uh, what are you doing, dude? Saturday Night, there you go. We'd always watch Saturday Night Live and Kids in the Hall. Jeopardy, old school SNL was so good, this new stuff sucks in my oh, opinion. Oh, dude, it's so bad now. It's so bad. The writers in entertainment, so we just had this big strike, right? I don't know if you guys knew this or not, but here in the States, especially here in Southern California, we just had this big, huge quote unquote I'm, I'm putting up the fucking the, the, the fingers the quote fingers um rider strike right these Smash people the like hit the sub box never miss any of my content drops here on warpath tv these people think that uh, that their ideas are gold and you know that they're they shit cinnamon and they piss rainbows and shit you know and and, and oh shit that scared the shit out of me um, all they really do is just, it's all woke propaganda. That's all it is. I mean, there's a couple of channels that I watch, like Geeks and Gamers and stuff, and there's some, um, a couple of insiders that come onto the show, and, um, they, they talk about how they'll be sitting in these production meetings, and the main people, the main producers and stuff will come in, and they'll be like, um, we don't want to hear from any of the white guys in the room. We just want to hear from the pink, purple, and green hair chicks with the fucking metal their in their faces. Stuff, they just rehash stuff that's already been done. Double a woke spin. Yeah, that's why 90% of the stuff that's coming out this year in movies and cinema and stuff is all either a prequel to a movie or a prequel or a sequel that's been made either in the 80s or 90s or the early 2000s. Nothing original is really coming out at all nothing at all and the st and the prequels and sequels that are coming out are utterly and totally destroying the whole story arc and storyline of everything that was made beforehand so you got things like perfect example star wars let's talk about fucking star wars for a second shall we here let me get the camera angle good so we could talk about fucking star wars <clears throat> let me clear my throat you took one of the greatest stories ever told, written, dialogued, everything. And you took it and you bought it from a guy that was basically, okay, you know, he didn't want to do it anymore. Okay, I get it. He's old. He just wanted to stop, right? You promised him. so overdone. You promised him that you were going to carry on the legacy. And then you gave it to this chick who is a big, huge feminist fucking whatever the fuck you want to call her and she totally took the whole storyline the canon everything that this guy did for the past 40 50 years however long he was coming up with the story of star wars he'd been doing it since he was in high school coming up with the backstory of star wars and totally shit on it and wipe their ass with it and then you come out and you say oh the force is female when they already had badass women in star wars to begin with you know what I mean? You already had badass women in, in Star Wars. But you gotta re remake the story and twist it up to make it to where, oh no, this chick that has no backstory, no anything, she's never been trained, but hey, she's the most powerful, the war, badass fucking bitch in the universe. Discord server at URL. Get the fuck out of here. They destroyed Star Wars. And they're doing it with everything. They did it to fucking... Uh, they did the Star Wars. They're doing it to Lord of the Rings. Oh my God, did they do it so bad? Lord, Lord of the Rings is one of my most favorite things in the whole world. And I refuse, I refuse to let them consider even contemplate 
whatever that bullshit is that they fucking released. What, what was that? Power of the Ring or whatever it is where they made Galadriel a fucking knight and shit. They made her some old high and powerful fucking warrior. Yeah. Get the fuck out of here with that, dude. Come on. Get out of here with that. All this woke shit. And then they strike because they want more money. And then now that AI's in the picture, they're not going to have any more fucking worker jobs because AI's doing all the work and shit for them. They're just trash, dude. It's all woke trash. The only thing of Star Wars that I really watch that I'm kind of intrigued with, believe it or not, right now, is the Bad Batch. That's the only thing that I really watch that I'm kind of intrigued with. I like it. It's got a good little storyline. I like Hunter. I relate closely to that guy, the character. I kind of want to get a half skull tattoo on my face. You know what I mean? Just to walk around. But, uh, yeah, man. They just ruined Star Wars. They're, they're ruining Lord of the Rings. But the, the good thing is, is that the fan base won't allow them to really ruin Lord of the Rings because they're like, nope, nope, we won't accept this as lore. Only the pink, purple, and green-haired motherfuckers will accept it as lore, and we don't accept them. So, you know, it's all out the door and kaput anyways. They did it to fucking Game of Thrones. You know what I'm saying? They, they totally fucked Game of Thrones over. If you think Season 7 and 8 of Game of Thrones was good... Then I got Swampland in the desert to sell you that's fucking excellent. I'm talking there's gold lined in the Swampland that I can sell you right now. Um, just they're doing it with everything. You know what I'm saying? Um, I did hear Fallout was okay. I'm hearing mixed mes messages with Fallout. I haven't seen it yet. I kind of want to give it a chance, but then I kind of don't want to at the same time. I wasn't really a Fallout guy, but I kind of want to give it a chance. Um, what was the other one that just came out? Uh, was it Twisted Metal? Twisted Metal, right? That one was kind of wonky. You know what I mean? It, uh, a little wonky. They just, they just try to make too much shit into this woke agenda that they got going on. Just stick to the fucking storyline that's already made, dude. Just, just stick to that shit. I don't give a fuck what fucking orientation you're fucking or who the fuck you're dying your hair to to appraise. Wake up with Warpath, a warm cup of coffee, some fun laughs here at 7 a.m. Avocado time every Monday through Saturday. People fucking make me sick. And I say it mostly because they make me sick because I worked in that business. I worked in that business for two years. I was a glazer. I did movie glass. So a couple of movies I worked on. I worked on the very first Fast and Furious. Um, I worked on some fucking movie with Gary Shandling where he was like an alien. He was sent to Earth to impregnate fucking human women and shit. I've, I've worked on a few movies where I was like, oh, okay, so this is how it goes down. I seen how it goes. And that was back in the day before everything was woke and shit. You know what I mean? It actually kind of sucks. Working in the movie and entertainment industry is fucking whack, dude. It's so whack. I'm the kind of person where once I get it's going to see you on work... I, you were long done with Van Horn. I mean, it pretty the much shows the wall by the way I play my video sale, games, right? It's just where I keep it. I start my show, I get something, like I get a game plan going, and boom, I immediately I start falling into a rhythm, and boom, we're getting shit done, right? We're like, dun, 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 There's a game plan. Shit's getting going, right? There's a rhythm. Ba 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 When you work in a movie business, there is no rhythm, dude. When you start to get into a rhythm, oh, union break. Oh, but I'm just getting started here. I'm just getting into a good rhythm. Can I finish? Nope. Got to go on your break. The if you don't go on your break, then we write you up. If you get so many write-ups, then you have to leave the set. If you leave the set so many times, then you're not allowed to come back, and then you lose this bonus and this and that. And These there's so many fucking stupid rules, dude, on the movie sets and shit. It's stupid retarded. I worked over at WB for a little while. That was, oh my god, lame. Lame. King of Queens. That's the show I worked on for a little bit. 
king of queens. Um, whose line is it anyways? With uh, Drew Carey. Just stupid shit, dude. You know, I don't think I've done these guys. We only need... We need two, right? Let's see, what, what time are we at? 8.21. We need two bounties from New Hanover. Targets looted and taken down with Bolas. Okay. So no matter what, we're going to get two of these three. Let's do this one. Right. We're going to kill as many birds with two stones as we can. All sweet. We're going to get our own lobby too, so I don't have to worry about no dick bag. That's really cool. What was your fab part of the experience overall? The food. The food. <laughs> that was it. Face green smiling, face green smiling. The catering trucks are the business. When you're on a movie set and you do get to have lunchtime and shit, like it's 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 the business, dude. <laughs> Loot the robber and find the evidence. Oh, okay. Man, let me get my shit ready here. Serious trouble when I get out of this. Shut your bitch ass up. Go to hell. Planning a raid of. Okay. That place is a mansion. Really? That's what they call it, the Van Horn Mansion. I didn't know that. Oh uh, wait, 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 wait. Let's do this the right way. There we go. Now we look like Vampire Hunter D. Yeah, and a lot of times too, um, like the catering trucks and shit had beer and stuff, and I was fucking alcoholic at this time, dude, so you better believe that I was pounding back a couple on my lunch break. Hide within the Van Horn Mansion and wait to stay undetected. Oh, okay. Smash that like. Hit that sub box. Never miss any of my content drops here on Warpath TV. This guy. I never seen a brother with fucking blonde chops. Oh, okay. I was gonna say, brother got blonde chops. Since you found like this, we're gonna have to give you some real work. All right, look it over again. I sure as hell don't trust that damn foreigner to tell us what it's worth. Oh, he's gonna be the first one in. Let him follow you. Kill him. Oh, oh Jesus. Oh. 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 Lord. Oh. We make more money in a day than you do in a year. Get smart.
Motherfucker, knock my head off, cuz. Watch. Made me spill fucking yak all of my three hundred dollar suit. Oh god, no. Pick up my hat, cuz. There we go. Big boy! Bo Bradshaw, what do they call you? Double B? Or BB? Or Bo? What do they call you? Huh? Huh? You didn't answer me? Huh, Big Top? Oh, you got homies coming, huh? Hang on a second. Let me do this real quick. Motherfucker, where'd you go? There we go. That's more like it. Let me tell you a little story. I'm gonna make you warm inside. Got some friends growing up. All the things they tried. <laughs> Rolling with the foxes. Or oh, is that a coyote? The jackrabbits. Then they gave me a gang of time to turn your fucking punk ass in. They're like, yeah, let's give him a half an hour. Taking forevers. That's a good shot, dude. You got me. Uh huh. Uh huh. What's wrong? Mira, what's wrong? You scared to come to town? Remove both bag blah 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 and re maintaining the supremacy of law. All right. What are your favorite weapons? Um, my favorite weapons are probably the bow, the pump action, and. I really like the double action revolvers, but they just don't hit hard, so probably the navy revolvers. I confess I'm sad to see them still alive, but well done anyway. There's your money.
fast travel. Back to the Van Horn. We just need one more. Let's see here. Can't do that one. Those guys are all packed up together. Oh, Everett Morgan. Let's read it. Have you been working on any sharpshooter awards? Um, yeah. Um, actually. Um, I was rocking combos. You know, a pistol and a revolver for the longest time to just try and match. Um, I'm rocking pistol... Uh, two weeks in a row because my revolver kills are so high so I'm just trying to match until they get even again I think when I get into fours I'm gonna go back to combos so a pistol and a revolver again um, I just rolled headshots you can see I'm just uh, I just maxed out bow headshots they won't let me reset that no more so some of these I haven't even started yet, but yeah, I mean, some of them are just maxed out. By the way, always go into your awards there and make sure that you guys are checking them either at least every day or every other day. That way you're not cheating yourself on XP, gold, and all that good stuff. Everett Morgan, wanted for his part in a recent train robbery and the death of a train conductor Everett Mormon is a Mormon let's try this again <clears throat> wanted dead or alive Everett Morgan for his part in a recent train robbery and the death of a train conductor Everett Morgan is wanted by the law ba -ba 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 -ba. let's go get this son of a bitch Some of them are crazy hard. MOG flushed face. Yeah. Ooh, the Viking tomb. Let us go to the Viking tomb. have here it's lying there right next to the road found me some bitter weed away from today's light goal light. let's try to hit that goal today everybody help me hit today's light goal of one zero you are all wicked awesome I only have 4x sharpshooter awards left to work on cat orange whistling oh look at you look at you miss the fancy pants so fancy. I mean, though, once you hit like level a thousand, though, I, I would imagine that's like, you know what I mean? Like, okay, I'm level 700. There's not a lot more to do. I've done everything in the game. Let's just fucking max out the challenges, right? I mean, that's about where you're at. My next story playthrough, I'm just going to try my hardest to get, like, 100%. Just get all the challenges I can knocked out. One by one at a time. Yeah. 
Alright, I gotta be on my toes because this is fucking cougar territory and I don't mean the good kind that you pick up at a bar at 2 o'clock in the morning on a Friday night. I'm talking about the, the bad kind. Claws, teeth, and big long furry tail and shit. Smash that like. Hit the sub box. Never miss any of my content drops here on Warpath TV. LOL. Wake up with Warpath, a warm cup of coffee, some fun laughs here at 7 a.m. Avocado time every Monday through Saturday. That's what I'm kind of looking for right now, because usually... Yeah. You hear it? Right there. No, it's over here. I hear it, dude. Y'all hear that motherfucker, right? Yep, yep, I see it. I seen it. It's chasing something. Here it comes, here it comes. Gotcha, bitch! Hell oh, yeah, three star too. I wish it was the full carcass, but fuck it. I'm like, why can't I fucking inspect this shit? Nice shot, MOG thumbs up. Thank you, thank you very much, thank you. Stop! Oh my god, I hate when this fucking horse does that shit. Timer, come on, man. Fuck. Focus on the clue. Oh, what is it? A comic book? What is he taking a shit back here? Smokey back here taking a shit! Oh, what was he doing? Eating corn, Smokey?
watched three of my friends do bows only at Fort Mercer talk. They all died by midwave one zero, eyes purple crying. Oh, that sucks. Make it all that way. Bows only. That's tough. I remember, um, I think it was Shots and I. Shots. There was, there was four of us, I think. But we used guns that were like Civil War guns, I think. Like, we only used guns that... You know what I mean? So I think it was like the one repeater, navy rifles, and double barrel shotguns or some shit. Dude, where the fuck is this guy? This is getting fucking stupid with the goddamn tracking already. This motherfucker better be over here. Oh my god! Don't do this. Boom. Nine for nine. Christ's sake! Oh wait, we gotta you turn him in, huh? Bastard. Anyone help! Dude, there's nobody out here. minutes six minutes ducky fresh you're wrong uh, 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 we've uh, completed uh, uh. the same challenge but with four peeps no good son of a bitch oh which is bows just bows and one handgun so you don't you don't go in there with two uh, holsters you go in there with one holster one sidearm Robles. Throwing knives, you tomahawks. Bastard. Fort Mercer, though. That's tough, because you got, um. You got those dudes that are fucking wicked long range out there. You damn idiot! Working the fucking, uh, Gatlin cannons and shit. Mike Mikes. You have a live bounty, MOGIs. Yeah. Yeah, you caught that. I know. What's up, D Scott? How you doing, bud? You gonna ruin this day. You hear me? What is the matter? Well, damn, bitch, don't walk in the middle of the fucking street. No sit-ins, no throwables. Gun all max bows only. Damn, that's gangster right there. D Scott, MOG waving hand, MOG smiling eyes. Come join the new Warpath TV Red Jetted Step Children Discord server at URL. I'm glad you brought him in alive. Nine for nine. There's your money. Oh yeah, we gotta catch a 
Fish. Fish. Prairie possums. Prairie pop. Toughest yet, with shotguns only at Fort Mercer. Damn hard to get those cannons. Oh, dude, I bet. How do you do it? Dean Scott, 10 pink waving. Run out of bounds, use incendiary ammo. Smash oh, the like. Okay. Hit the sub box. Never miss any of my content drops here on Warpath TV. That makes sense. Oh, there's Jingle Jangle down here. I mean, if I'm in the neighborhood, I might as well grab it. the four hundred. It's got like pink flowers in here. Wild man. Definitely need that. Definitely need some of this. Alright, good boy. That was fancy. Little little 180 Ollie right there. Here we go, Prairie Poppy. One. Two. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. A chance to play with Bullet yet?
fuck is that? Nah, I have an Xbox. There we go. Gotta be different. MOG face with rolling eyes. One more. There we go. There's five. Hey. Over here, my little spot. My little fishing spot here. Oh. I forgot. Eyes purple crying. Gotta be different. You know what I mean? I gotta be different. I can't I can't roll in the same box as y'all. Gotta be different, cuz. I'm just kidding. I mean I'm hoping that uh we're in a lake, I believe. What do you say? I'm hoping that when I can get everything back together here. I'm going to a rebel brew. <laughs> I'm a rebel, brah. I'm a loner, Dottie. A rebel. There we go. Uh, I'm hoping that I could get uh, like a used Xbox One and I could like kind of just work on my Xbox character. I kind of left hanging. Maybe just do some clips, you know, not so much stream with that, but just do some clips. Hell uh, yeah, paddle your ass off, homie. What the fuck? Is that guy off map? That's the fastest I've ever seen an NPC paddle before. Was paddling quick lol. Yeah, right. Motherfucker was paddling to save his life. Oh, maybe there's a uh, somebody My in town. Lord. Wake up with me. A warm cup of coffee. Some fun last year at 7 a.m. Avocado I, time every Monday through Saturday. I totally meant to do that. Avoiding griefers too, face green smiling. when you'd be back word five bucks dude for real you give me more for the fish than the fucking pelt I mean, fuck it it's off my fucking horse Slamming salmon. You change your mind? I'll be right on. Shizzle. What time is it? 
55. Basically done all the dailies we want to do today. Generals I don't really care about. As long as we get the 9 for 9 done. James Langton's a bitch. Posse vs. Sucks. And whole animal carcasses is just like a pain in the ass. So. Wait, let's see who this is. <laughs> He's just a baby. He's just a baby. Just got released on furlough. <laughs> Kick his ass, sea bass. Damn, it didn't take him long. That's fucking hilarious. I mean, he's not killing anybody. He's just beating everybody up. That's fucking funny. Oh, now he's shooting. <laughs> Watching the youngsters, little puppy, low levels, just fucking wreak havoc sometimes. You are a pig, Crips. He's a good boy. He's a good boy. Who's a good boy? Just a good boy. Yes, you are. Who's a good boy? Who's the goodest boy? Just a good boy. The good boy with your bubbles. All right, go take your ass and lay down. Quit shitting in my goddamn tent. You always gotta walk away, like, from the, the wagon and the mailbox when you want to clean your weapons, because for some reason it's just it's glitched out like that. It won't allow you to clean your guns near there for some reason. Alright. Well, alright. Let's do this one. And this one, and this one, and this one. Alright. Oh, that shit's fucking mad dirty. Nine o'clock. 
o'clock. Got all the dailies done. Alright. Let's do this. Let's see. Last time we did bring a goddamn posse. So let's do the hanging of Mr. Tom Davis. This is actually a really, really fucking fun one. So I gotta make sure I'm on point for this. Oh, the shoddy is good. I'm trying to remember what I need. Should we bring the Lancaster instead of the shotgun? Yeah, you know, we'll keep the shotgun. Let's do it. All right, going to make my last rounds into the chat here. Let's hit that like button if you guys are new. New to the setup. Let's hit that like, like button. How do you access that screen for those Lou missions? Uh, you hit start, you go into your progress. And then you go over to the bottom right hand corner into missions and it'll give you the option to land of opportunities. Sub. Help me hit today's like goal of one zero. You are all wicked awesome. Six eight three. We gotta bump those numbers up. One seven more to seven zero zero, my peeps. Skipping the rest. Donations. If you would like to support my work, drop a super chat or just donate to my channel. Please hit the cash app link. URL. Title. Smoke it if you got it. Warpath TV. Current stream title. Red Dead Online Weekly Reset 99 Roll Grind Free Aim Tips Tricks Comedian Voice Actor Funny. Mm -hmm. Got it all in there. Boy, I tell you what, sometimes fuck good. Sometimes it's fucking terrible. So, you know, it's just a mixed bag, which is whatever you get. You know, it's like sticking your hand in the fucking hat. And you're like, uh, what number am I going to get? Am I going to get two? Am I going to get four? Am I going to get seven? Boo. I got to do more of them to access that posse mission. Shooting fake people is my pleasure. I'm loading into the fucking screen there, sorry, I'm a little late to the party, I apologize, I'll be there in one second, I'll be there in one second, alright, they forgot to put the cheese on my uh, pastrami sandwich, I was a little angry, Mafia Don, I know you would understand. I know you would. Here we go. Here You're we gonna go. hang young Tom Davies. Your friend, the Marshal. Hang him for being your friend and doing good in a bad world. Montez's boys. Gonna teach goodness a lesson. Teach law a lesson. Tell Some order it bread. don't exist Make no more in this chaos of kiss. a world. They got him in tumbleweed, and they're gonna lynch him. Or they're gonna lure you in there and lynch all you. Guess you'll have to figure that out. <clears throat> yeah. Come on, let's go. Magua, let's go. All right, it's coming. Sure, I get on Viper. Let's go. You, I'll be your Uber. Let's go. Killed Alfredo there. Killed him without due process. No judge, jury, just an executioner. He crossed right. the line, and now Alfredo's man, they're crossing it too. Oh, Jonesy. When good folks break the rules, well, 
they should know that bad folks are just gonna break them worse. And now the executioner is himself condemned. I you you forgot to make that turn at Albuquerque. Did carry out the deed, but he might already be done for when we arrive. Sure, we'll save him if we can. But if we can't, well, either we'll join him or we will see. It. You gotta help. The whole town's overrun. Bandits have the marshal and, and the sheriff too. They're gonna hang him any moment. Is that a gun in the your pocket, or are you just happy to see me? Sounds like we're here in time, at least. Come on. Nah, I'm talking to Get Viper. He's riding on the back back here. Blood. I feel a little something poking me in the back. Listen <laughs> here. These two men are killers. The worst kind of killers. The kind that hide behind the law. So today, Marshal Davies and Sheriff Freeman are going to get what's coming. Do it. If I could do it, I'd kill him again. Do it. Dumb. Hey, I'm gonna bum rush Davies. Is that cool? I'm gonna bum rush the rope. You guys keep me cover. Motherfucker. Man, that was awesome. We fucking we did that good, y'all. You go ahead, man. Go ahead. You're right here. Go ahead. I got you. I got you. Tio Choco. Viper needs an Uber. Need a ride, bud? Come on, Viper. Let's go. Jump on, buddy. Come on. There you go. There you go. Come on, Bubba. There you go. Hey, yo, I got Viper. We's on our ways. Oh, wait, hold on. Hold on, I got a couple of assholes over here by me. Hold on one second over here. Okay, not no more. It's hey, he's a, he's a strong, quiet types. He's strong, quiet types. Oh 
shit, these motherfuckers is way up. It's up to these guys. Turn on the turbo! Hey, turn on the turbo! Put it on like seven boost. Come on, Viper. Come on, Viper. Oh, fuck, my horse got fucking shot. Come on, Viper, get on, bro. She's got Uber Unlimited right now, Viper. Uber Black. sure about you, Mr. Jones, but then you went and saved my neck. <laughs> well, I ain't gonna make a habit of it. All of you, thank you. I mean it, thank you. Yes, thank you. I don't like requiring help, but this time I did. Marshal Davies, all of you, thank you. <laughs> ain't that fine. I was thinking we should leave before Montez's ghost decides to pay us any further visits. So you are a good fella, Mr. Jones. Me? No, never. I just like watching what other folks is, that's all. There's a word for fellas like you. Wise? Is that the word? Come, Marshal. Help me get home. Been <laughs> quite enough excitement for a clapped out old fool, well past his best, for one day! Friends. I'll see you again, I hope. But Don't worry, I next got you. time, I got under better circumstances, I trust. <laughs> GG's, my peeps. GG's. fun good gr good group of people too they're funny mafia down was pretty cool especially when i turned down the old italian accent he really liked that over there ah you like that let me finish up right here in the camp too it's good stuff it's good stuffs What's that doppelganger doing over here? Who's that fucking doppelganger? I like gold! <laughs> yeah. 
Yeah. Well, with that all being said, we're going to end this show here. Not going to string it out too long. Bore you guys any more than I have to. So uh, we'll be back tomorrow morning for some Warpath Wednesday. Bright and early. 7 a.m. avocado time as always. Hope to see you guys here. Uh, thank you all for being here today. Thank you guys all for uh, joining in in the chat, smashing that like, and being a part of the sub community. Much love and respect to you all. I hope you enjoy the rest of your Tuesday. And as always, Thanks. please do not Life let the now. man. MOG waving hand. Oh, thank you. Thank you. MOG victory sign. Thanks, Warpath. Oh, thank you. Thank you, guys. Much, much respect, y'all. And uh, yeah, don't let the man or the woman get you down. And like I always say, Stay fresh, stay funky. Emoji victory hand. Stay Medium sexy. Dark skin tone. Stay salty. Stay frosty, my peeps. We'll see you all tomorrow morning. Until then. Peace. Wake up with Warpath, a warm cup of coffee, some fun laughs here at 7am. Avocado time every Monday through Saturday. <laughs>